right, boys and girls, and uh, welcome to Gordon Guitar. So this time around we have a song from Martin Garrix featuring Bono and The Edge, and it's called We Are The People. You can't separate Bono from The Edge, and what a great collaboration this one is. A great track from uh, Martin Garrix. Uh, pretty easy to play, uh, the only thing is the different strumming patterns, which we will look at pretty soon. But first off, the chords. We don't need any capo here for this one, and it's only four chords, so let's start. First off, it's the C here, so it's third on A, second on D, open G, first B, and open E. And then the F chord, like this. You need to bar the first fret here, all strings, and the rest will be third on A, third on D, and second on G. So there's your F. Then we move on to the A minor. So uh, open A, second D, second G, first B, and open E. And the final chord is the G. So third E, second A, open D, open G, third B, and third E. So there's your four chords, and we can uh, now look at the chord progression because it will be the same through the whole song, through the verse, the pre chorus, and the chorus. And the chord progression will be C to F to A minor to G and back to F. So there's your chord progression through the whole song. Uh, the only thing is we're going to change up the strumming pattern because uh, this one is uh, a typical song that builds up from the verse to the pre-chorus and, and to the chorus. Then. So first off for the verse we're going to play uh, four downs and that's uh, one. So uh, for the C we're going to play two times so in total eight downs. So, five, six, seven, eight, F, two times, three, four, one, two, three, four, A minor, one time, three, four, G, one time, three, four, and F, two times, three, four, one, two, three, four. So, for C here. So that's just for get you some uh, perspective here of how it could sound when you play this kind of strumming pattern. So uh, four downs for the chords here and two for F, uh, sorry, two for C, two for F, one for A minor, one for G and two for F. You're gonna play this chord progression two times in the verse, so in the same way. Then when we come to the pre-chorus here, uh, it will be the same amount of uh, times for the each chord. So uh, for C, two times, for F, two times, A minor one, G one, and F two times. But here we will change up the strumming pattern here. So it will be down, 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 only downs here. So down, 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 down. And that sounds pretty odd, but it, it, that's just to display how, how the feeling is when you're going to play this strumming pattern. So it will be... So down, 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 down. In total here it's eight downs, but it's not just eight straight downs like this. It is down. That's 
the feeling here. So. Mm -hmm. the pre-chorus, uh, so two rounds of C, two rounds of F, one of A minor, one G, and one F, the same. And it's pretty much the same in the chorus, the only thing here we're gonna change up is the strumming pattern again. So here it's, um, you're gonna more, work more with your right hand, so if I explain for you it will be down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down up pretty much downs and ups here but i'm gonna explain how this is uh, yeah how we're gonna think of it so that's the feeling and that's the sound so down down up down up down down up down up down down up It's hard to just get these uh, downs and ups uh, and to count these, so you need really to get the feeling for this strumming pattern. Uh, but that's uh, how it should be played in the song, because uh, yeah, as I told you before, it adds up in tension, and the chorus here that's where uh, the big release comes here. So if I illustrate with the, the chord progression, it will sound like this. That's the feeling, and uh, it's uh, yeah, uh, you gotta get this uh, in the blood, so to speak, so you can play with the feeling here. And it uh, doesn't matter if you play wrong, like I did recently here, because uh, there's a lot of downs and ups there. And the only thing is to just uh, be on, on the right timing here to switch in the right uh, time here to the new chord, like this. So if you just uh, mess it up sometimes, doesn't matter, it will sound great anyway. So uh, yeah, the song goes on in a pretty same fashion here, another verse, pre-chorus and chorus, and that is how the song ends. So uh, this pretty much covers this song guys, a wonderful uh, song from Martin Garrix and Bono and The Edge. I hope you enjoyed this one, if you did, please leave a comment and uh, be a subscriber. Don't forget, play tuned.